Greetings. Marketing wizard Jim Ackerman here with your Good, Bad, and Ugly Ads marketing tip of the day. And today's tip, we're going to talk about yet another of the weapons of influence. Remember, we talked about one of those a couple of tips ago. Well, today we're going to talk about the principle of rapport and establishing rapport. It's the basic idea that we like who we're like, or maybe it's better said, we like to buy from people who we think are like us. If you want people to buy from you, be like them. Good technique for making that happen is to match and mirror. If somebody has a particular way of speaking, try to match that way of speaking. If there's certain phrases that they use or certain pacing, certain way they hold their head or move their hands, if you will match that, they're more likely to think, hmm, that guy or gal is just like me. And they're likely to like you more because of it. You can do it with posture. You can do it with tone of voice. You can do it with the speed of speech. Just match and mirror as closely as possible. Now, you may think, they'll think I'm making fun of them. They'll think I'm mimicking them. The truth of the matter is, they probably won't ever even notice it. Now, you might think that this is manipulative. But the truth of the matter is, aren't we all trying to manipulate people? Aren't we all trying to get people to like us? Aren't we all trying to get people to see our point of view? This is a way that you can be more successful at doing that. And you can do it in your writing as well. Make sure that you write the way your customers talk. When you do that, they're more likely to believe you're one of them and they're more likely to buy. Now, subscribe to the channel and don't forget to leave your comments below. And don't forget to critique and leave your comments on the marketing. Um, and don't forget to critique and leave your comments on the marketing specimen coming up in the next episode of Good, Bad, and Ugly Ads. See you then.